Tony Khan speaks about AEW getting bigger opportunities than ever before with Warner Brothers Discovery. Actor Jeremy Allen White to play Carrie Von Erich in The Iron Claw. Ricky Steamboat returning to the ring in November. Christopher Daniels and Michael Nakazawa no longer suspended by AEW. Tony Khan has commented on the relationship between AEW and Warner Brothers Discovery. The AEW president appeared on an episode of SportyCast released on Thursday. During the conversation, Tony Khan spoke about AEW's key revenue drivers and opportunities for integrations with other Warner Brothers Discovery's properties. Saying, quote, Live events is a huge revenue driver. Merchandising is a huge revenue driver. We have big sponsorships now. DraftKings has come in and been an amazing sponsor for AEW this year. The AEW president will continue to speak on how important television rights deals are for the growth of the company. They have really been so good to us and I feel like not only was the original leadership so great to take a chance on an unknown company, but then post-merger the Discovery leadership that's come in has been so supportive and we're getting opportunities now with the new management even bigger than we've ever gotten before. The Iron Claw, the upcoming biopic on the Von Erich family has cast its carry Von Erich. It was announced via Deadline today that actor Jeremy Allen White will play Carrie Von Erich in The Iron Claw. White will co-star in the film alongside Zac Efron and Harris Dickinson. Jeremy Allen White stars in the FX series The Bear and was previously part of the cast for Showtime Shameless. Deadline wrote that this is going to be based on the true story of the Von Erichs. Follows the rise and fall of the family dynasty of wrestlers who made a huge impact on the sport from the 1960s to the present day. The Von Erich family tragedy has previously been chronicled on Vice TV's Dark Side of the Ring in 2019 and an edition of ESPN's 30 for 30 Shorts in 2015. Twelve years after he last got into the ring, Ricky the Dragon Steamboat will return to action as part of the Return of the Dragon, a big-time wrestling event in Raleigh, North Carolina on Sunday, November 27th. The match itself was not announced. The 69-year-old last wrestled alongside his son, Richie Steamboat, in June 2010 at an FCW show. Steamboat has become more of a regular on wrestling TV this year. He appeared at a February MLW event, was part of the NWA 74th anniversary weekend and subsequent TV tapings, and was the special guest timekeeper for the mid-August AEW Dynamite and Rampage that was House of the Dragon themed. A future A&E WWE documentary is also expected for this year. Christopher Daniels and Michael Nakazawa are no longer suspended from AEW. They joined Pat Buck and Brandon Cutler, whose suspensions were also lifted recently. Kenny Omega, the Young Bucks, A Steel, and CM Punk remain suspended as the investigation into the backstage altercation following the all-out media scrum continues. Dave Meltzer wrote that Christopher Daniels, Pat Buck, Brandon Cutler, and Michael Nakazawa are off of suspension because the investigation showed they were only trying to break up the fight. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, make sure to stick around here on F4W Online for more wrestling news and podcasts.